Hey, you guys, what's going on? Welcome to Books, Beauty, and Stuff. I am doing a review on Best Laid Plans by Rebecca Hunter. Now, this is actually the first <clears throat> Harlequin Dare book I'm reviewing on my channel. But I also talked about it a bit in one of my book review um, news. So I'm going to put it in the link bar below so you guys can check that out as well because I go into more detail about that. Harlequin, um, Harlequin Dead is a new imprint from Harlequin, clearly. Well, duh. And I just have to say, when they talk about Dare and the way they talk about the male body parts or the women body parts, the female body parts, sex in general, sexual uh, stuff in general, I'm going to tell you, they have no filter. Um, Ooh. But let me just say this book was hot, romantic, spicy, fast, and it definitely teaches you a little bit about life and things like that, how people, you know, not necessarily um, give up things, but more so, like, you know, sometimes sacrifice the name of love for who they love. That's what I meant. Okay, so we're going to talk about Cameron Black, um, Cameron Blackmore and Jackson. Jackson McAllister. Girl, when I tell you Jackson is off the chain, honey. They met in a bar one night about Sydney, and Sydney is takes place in Australia. Now, first of all, how the whole thing started was um Yeah. How the whole thing started was Cameron basically the dad basically wanted to hire a PR firm because they wanted to get more positive recognition and thing instead of them always sleezing around with women. Um, they're part, one of their partners is married to his wife. Cameron is single, Simon, don't know, and Max is actually more so fascinated by another woman. And I think Simon is too, but we'll, we'll talk more about that later. Child. I definitely can't wait to see about them three. Well, them, yeah, them other two. So anywho. With that being said, um, Jackson is supposed to let the PR director. They made in a bar one night. Of course, they didn't know who they was, and they bombed. It was the best orgasm Jackson had in her life. <laughs> Cause she had an ex boyfriend who was a loser. So, child, that was a mess in itself. And you know, of course, they get to know each other um, as she get to know. And of course, tension builds between them. It's like a conflict of. Should I do it or should I not? Or should we just keep it professional or keep it professional, friendly, and fun? Um, I, I, I get to understand Cameron doesn't want to be like his father because his father was a whore himself. And one thing I say about this, you have children, you went out, met another woman. So I'm guessing Cameron has a half-brother somewhere. And you basically had another family uh, um, without his mother. So basically his granddad was like his father too. So this is now he said, I'm staying with this company for my grandfather, not my father. Basically, he's saying, bump my father. I'm, it's my grandfather. But overall, it was a good book. You know, of course, the guys had plans to try to sabotage the situation and things like that. You know, but they said, no, we're not going to do that. Once they, after that, they was like, no, let's just be mature and get this done. And, you know, H-E-A, happy ever after, happily ever after ending. Excuse the banger next door. That's just my neighbors. But... I truly enjoyed this book. I truly enjoy what came out of it. And I'm just going to say those scenes, baby. But definitely, this is my first read from this author as well, too. As long as my, along with my first review from Harlequin Dare as well, like I said earlier. So definitely, I definitely enjoyed this book. It was very fast paced. So yeah. Anyway, if you guys want to check it out, check her stuff out in the link bar below. And I'm also going to put... Her link from Harlequin below, too, so you guys can check out possibly her other works as well, too. Anywho, thank you guys for looking at my video. Thank you guys for checking it out. And thank you guys for giving a lot of these authors, a lot of our authors a chance, too, as well, too. Anyway, talk to you soon. Bye.